Hello everyone and welcome to another one of Xander's One Shots. We're going to be having a look at lines today, a little fun zen abstract puzzle game uh, created by a company called Gameus, where you either add or remove dots from the screen in order to start a colourful race. Uh, well, it, actually it's probably better if I just show you the gameplay. We're going to jump straight in here. Um, there are unlockables, uh, as with many, many other games, but we need to complete certain areas before moving on. I'm going to start right at the start. I did the tutorial level just to make sure that the game would run itself, um, but we'll uh, we'll go in there and we'll uh, see how it goes. So, there's a red dot already on here. That's going to expand out and fill the area, and it wants me to create the longest line. So we click in, it starts to spread, it runs back, and blue out does red. Very simple, very, very fun. Hmm. Fence, place one point. I'm guessing. Here? There we go. Uh, now, could we put it... No, so we can't put it directly near another point. We could put it here, though, knowing that it's going to expand out. Oh, blue got way more. Blue got way more. We'll have to try that again. Ooh. Is where they go. All right, let's go here this time. Much better. Now for fold, we'll probably want to go here so we get up and around that corner and down that way. As long as we're closer to that corner, then we'll get it. So let's go here. Here, oh, and there. Very nice. Okay, ribbon. We got two points that we can go for. Uh, so that's going to be one here and, well, one right there, I guess. We'll lock them in. So they started off with a little bit more, and we totally, totally outdid it. Hmm. Two points for Delta. We go here, we'll get up into this area before it becomes a problem, and then we go down here, I guess? We'll get one there. And we'll get one... So we could completely lock it in, but then it's going to come around that way. We'll go there. Lovely stuff. Blocks. Little, like, 3D cubes, depending on which way you look at them from. Oh, we've got two points. Hmm... If we go there, we'll make it down that way first, so that covers those two. And for these... Let's go... there. It's all about careful positioning, just to make sure you do get that uh, little in... Just beat it at the, uh, at the corner points. One point. Well, that's going to have to be right on that corner. Oh, black just beat. Okay, we can uh, we can do better. I think it's going to have to be down here, but just just about there. Again. 
again. Apparently we're not very good at this. This should go much better though. If we go here, we'll cover the entire left hand side. And there is a little bit of randomization to it because of course, as you can see, the actual points are appearing in different places. So for the diagonal, we've got two points. We could go That's the wrong place. I've just realized that now. Still got it, but uh, it would have been much more efficient if I'd moved up a little bit further. Five points, okay. So we'll go there. In fact, I probably only need three for this. Two, three, four, five. Let's lock them in. Sydney Harbour Bridge. Two points coming in. Uh, let's... Let's go just here. That's going to come down there and that way. And we'll go just here on this side. Massive, massive amounts. I do love the way it, uh, it generates a pretty nice, uh, pretty nice uh, picture as it's going along. Let's uh, let's switch along and we'll try the next mode type. Hmm. Win the level three times in a row to earn a bronze trophy. Okay, a razor mode, pretty straightforward. So if we're pink, we want to get rid of this one, I assume. No, no, I should have got rid of that one over there. Okay, we'll try it again. That's going to be better. We got over 50%. Let's, uh, let's try streaking through it again. Get rid of that. Nope. We want to get that bronze trophy. Okay, that's one win. We should make it to that in time. So let's get rid of this one. Oh, didn't quite make it to the corner down the bottom. We're totally going to get this bronze trophy. I have to get it. I want to get it. I'm assuming it calculates whether it's possible or not just by uh, which one you're removing. Let's get rid of this one. Mm, no. Apparently I'm not very good at this. We are losing more than we're winning. Let's get rid of the one down there. Ooh, didn't quite head them off at the top, but we just managed it down the bottom. So that's our first win. I think I'll get rid of that entire one down there. So it's going to take it a while to come back round. Let's take out that one. So we get the entire left side. Yeah, I think that may be the right way to do this one. 
looking to eliminate everything on one entire side. So let's go for this. That was very close. Oh geez, this is not a great place to start. Uh, let's get rid of that one and we'll hope we run through over there. Just. So that's two. One more and we get the bronze trophy. Oh my word. And we are in the worst place. Let's get rid of this one. Yay! Okay, we got a bronze trophy. And it unlocks more levels. Okay, that's uh, that's good to know. Win percentage fifty six percent. Okay, let's uh, let's carry on with the other levels. Hmm. Remove two points. We'll get rid of that one. That will allow us to come down around and probably. And get rid of this one as well. I think that made a little difference. Should have got rid of the top one. So we're going to get that area. Let's get rid of that. That's going to allow us down all the way over there. And from here... We'll get rid of that one. Still not quite getting it. That's going to be a sensible one to go. And these are too close to each other. Let's get rid of this one down here. Just about. And when they're close to each other, there's no real uh, point in removing them because they just end up getting overwritten. We're blue. Uh, we need to get rid of... T that one can stay. This one can go. And... Getting rid of that one's going to make no difference because we're going to get that corner. Getting rid of this one will make a difference because we'll be able to get up there first. And it is a little bit tactical. I mean, it's zen, it's abstract, it's artistic. But it's, it's relaxing in the way that it plays. And from the looks of it, the mechanics are... Mm, they're interesting enough. Let's get rid of the... Hmm. These are going to be fighting anyway. That's going to come down about the same pace. Let's get rid of that one. Two away, we're going to make it to that corner first. So let's get rid of this one. It looks like there's, there's enough mechanics that are being introduced as we go along uh, with the different unlockable modes that we saw from the main menu. That there's a lot of different ways you can play this. You know what, I'm actually just going to get rid of these two. And we're going to secure this bottom section. Okay, Tetris, remove two points, we are, oh, pink. Uh, that can go, that's going to give us all the way around the edge. And this can go, this is going to give us the top section. Oh, ever so close. All right, we'll try that again. So we've got all of that. Let's get rid of that. And we're not going to make it in time for that. We could get rid of this one, actually. And that gives us over half of the thing by itself. Ooh, I thought it would. I mean, we, we do have more, but that snuck in faster than I expected. Okay, we are the... Let's get rid of that. And let's get rid of this one, actually. No, 
no. One more time. One more time. Oh. You can go. And... And you can go. Oh, Red just got in. Just. I say it's relaxing. I mean, it is relaxing, but at the same time, it's challenging. So, we're not going to get up to that in time. Maybe we could do it. No, that's going to come down there. Let's get rid of you. Victory is assured. Okay, we're the green. If we get rid of this one, we've got that corner down. If we get rid of this one, we've actually got most of this side, I reckon. Wonderful. Two points, gotta go. They gotta go. Uh, these two are. Um, but let's get rid of you, and we'll get rid of you, and we'll see how much we manage to get of this. Just edging ahead. Visually, it looked like the uh, the ready orange color actually had more. Uh, so we're ooh, yeah. take out these and we'll try and just secure this side let's get rid of that we'll get rid of that and we'll try and beat it round the edge I guess no sometimes when you start in a superior position, I mean, this is a great one over here. Let's get rid of that, and we'll get rid of that. So it's racing from the edge in for all three of us. Nice! We're green, we've got to get rid of two points. Uh, let's get rid of these two, actually. No, we got, we got way trapped in. Don't care about these three. Like, mm. we'll get rid of that one, and I think that's going to be faster for us. We'll get rid of this one. It was. Is it enough? No, not quite. Okay, that one's got to go, and we're not going to beat that one, but we could get rid of this. Let's try that. Obviously, my uh, spatial recognition is not amazing with this. You go. And if we get rid of this, we may run around to the corner before the other. Don't think we'll quite beat it across, but this might. Get rid of that one. Should have got rid of the pink. I should have got rid of all of it, but uh, uh, let's try getting rid of those two there. We'll try and secure the left side of the board. Hey, a tactic that actually worked. We got rope mode. All right, let's uh, let's give rope mode a go. This is quite a lot of fun. So, rope mode. Win level three times in a row to earn a bronze trophy. Let's uh, do the tutorial. Drag from here to 
there. Oh, we've made a, a new line or a new line potential. I see. So we're blue, so we're going to tie this rope to there as a direct path. Are we going to beat it? Are we going to beat it? Not quite, but uh, we got a long streak from it. Okay, we're blue, so we're going to give ourselves that there. And I'm actually going to tie it straight there. So we should make it up to here and then back along. Yeah, that's what I wanted to see. All about tactical positioning. And it does introduce very interesting dynamics to it. Okay. So we've got two ropes. Let me just turn my alarm off. Apologies for that. How are we going to manage this? Well, we're going to not beat it up to that corner. But we can probably beat it down there. And then we want a nice long path to get. Ah, can we can we tie it to the edge? If not, we kind of want to get the, the longest rope possible. Which I think is going to be that. There we go. So using the ropes for extra line area. Tying two ropes. It's sensible for us to get in on this as soon as possible. Uh, let's go down there. And we're going to do the same up this way. Let's try there. Just in time. Hmm. Tying two ropes for red. We can make it into this corner. But that's not actually really going to help us. We'll get one going round there. And we'll make it into this corner over here. Is it going to be enough? Is it going to be enough? I hope it's going to be enough. Hey! So we're blue. we got to do three ropes. And get that down there. That'll give us part of that. We can cut that one off that direction. And then maybe we actually just go for another one of the long ones. Oh, just made it to the corner first. Look at that. We over, like, overdid all of the other colours. All the other colours put together. Alright. Two ropes, uh, we'll go in. Actually, this is really easy, this one. We'll go in like that, and we'll go in like that. Not even a challenge based on where they fell. So just as a reminder, this is uh, Lines. This is produced by a company called Gamius. If you do enjoy it, I'm going to be putting a link in the description below. Um, we're going to finish out these last couple of levels and see what the next mode is. Uh, we get two... Um, that's probably going to get us the court. In fact, yeah, it's almost certainly going to get us the corner. They're going to 
cover that themselves. We've got this side down. That's giving us that side. So what can we do that's going to benefit us? You've got to come all the way down like that. You're going to... Mm. None of those are particularly great. It's a bit of a shame. But by the time that's come down there, we'll have only got around to like here. Maybe our best bet is actually going to be to introduce another full line across like that. And we'll have to hope it's enough extra distance, which it is. Okay, on to track, we get two ropes. We'll put that one in there. Hopefully that's enough for us to get up and... Where else is going to be good? Let's try another really, really long parallel line. Those extra length lines can make such a big difference. We didn't actually make it in there, which is a, a surprise. I misjudged that. <laughs> Gamius, the company that actually produced the game. We get one rope. Where are we going to put it? We're going to put it from there to there. Ain't it pretty? Ain't it pretty? Knife mode. All right, let's have a very quick look at knife mode. So with knife mode, you cut the line. Simple, effective. And then we get to cut one line. We, we could cut this one here, I guess. Brilliant. So this is Lines. Uh, as I said, it's produced by Gamius and there is going to be links in the description below. Um, it comes with a level editor, there's uh, achievements, there's Twitch integration as well, um, where people who are watching on Twitch can actually play with you. So that's a very, very nice feature. And um, yeah, I'm really quite enjoying this. Let's have a look at the daily challenge. Win Honeycomb three times in a row. So we get to place five points. Well, that's gonna go one there. One there, one there, we'll block you in, and we'll block you in. There's the first, we'll go there, mm, can't quite get that, but we'll go there, we'll go there, and there. And you know what, we'll go here. A little bit close to the end. That's two that we need. On the corner. Just that side. We get two more points, so we'll go for that one there, although we probably didn't need that one. And... We'll go up here, actually. Ooh, challenge failed. And that's it. That is it. Um, this is Lions. If you have enjoyed it, uh, then be sure to give this a thumbs up. And uh, let me know if you want to see more one-shots as different games come across my path. Thank you very much for watching, and I will see you soon.